Good day, and welcome to Hiroshima University's English Podcast. Hi, everyone. Welcome to Hiroshima University's English Podcast. I'm Joe. And I'm Kay. And today we're talking about something everyone loves. We're talking about insects, bugs. Yay! <laughs> Do people really love insects?、Um, they don't love them, but、um, they think they're very interesting because、uh, either they're afraid of them,、uh-huh, afraid of them,、uh-huh. or they're very curious about the strange things that insects can do. Okay, let's talk about insects. 皆さんこんにちは。今日は虫についてのお話をしたいと思います。人によってはちょっとあまり得意じゃないかもしれないんですけど、まあ、まずは英語で虫の名前を言えるかどうか5つクイズをしてみたいと思います。日本人にも馴染みのある虫ばっかりなので、結構簡単に予想できると思います。頑張ってください。Right, everyone, can you name these five insects? If you get four of them, you are really, really smart. Yes. Okay, the first one here is a very common insect.、Um, it has six legs. Yes. And there are a lot of them on Earth. There are about one quadrillion, which is equal to 100 million billion. Okay, so one quadrillion is. <laughs> 日本だと千兆ですね。ゼロが十五個ついてます。<laughs> <laughs> there are a lot of them on Earth.、Uh, and also, they're very strong、uh-huh, insects. They're very、uh-huh. strong. They can carry 20 times their、okay. weight. 20 times、wow. their weight. Right. Okay. okay, everyone, you got that insect? Six legs, very strong. There are lots of them. They can carry 20 times their weight. The answer is. Ants. Ari des. Yes, ants, right. Ants, of course, live in colonies. Mm-hmm. Um, 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 Yeah, they go in and they steal it and they bring it back to their、Aww. own colony and bring it up by themselves,、Aww. right? And one third type of famous ant in Japan is the fire ants. Hiari, ne? That's, That's, right. Right. That's right. They sting, they bite, and also、uh, they're really hard to get rid of.、Uh, okay. So they're kind of spreading around、Aww. the world like、ね、that.、Right. ね、okay, the second, that was pretty easy. Ants, you all got that one, right?、Uh-huh. The second one is also very common in Japan.、Um, these guys are usually green、uh-huh. and they catch insects with their front legs. Okay, my ass did it. That's right. They catch insects with their front legs. And sometimes people like to have them as pets. Really? Pets, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, everyone, you got that one? These green insects, they catch insects with the pet, with the front legs. The answer is. It's praying mantises. Right, praying is like in a church, you pray. Or, 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 Jumping, they can jump like cats through the air,、uh-huh. uh, turning their bodies like that. And also, they can change colors.、Wow. Uh, they can look like the brown of the tree、okay. or the green of the leaf, like、oh. that. And one other interesting thing about praying mantises is that sometimes、yes. after having sex,、uh-huh. the females eat the males. <laughs> yes, you don't want to be a, a male <laughs> praying mantis, do you? <laughs> yeah, good for you to be a human. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Okay, and the third insect is also a really beautiful one. They have big transparent wings. Right, and very large eyes, so、okay. they can see in every ほうほう direction. ほうほう、mm, everyone, just on <laughs> these clues, can you guess it? They have big transparent、mm. wings and they have large eyes. Okay. And, and they're kind of beautiful, I think, okay. right? Okay. You got the answer, everyone? The answer is. Dragonflies, tombo des. Right, dragonflies in English.、Mm-hmm. Right, dragon sounds kind of scary, right? <laughs> so, in foreign countries,、uh, especially Europe, they kind of have a scary image、oh, like、really? that. But、uh, in Japan, they have kind of a beautiful image, it's right? It's actually a good luck. Yeah, 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 yeah. Tombo wa ne, kachimushi te yu gurai dakara. Right, right. 
Anyways, these dragonflies are very expert flyers. They can fly straight up、uh-huh. or they can hover. Okay, hovering can できます。Right, and they often have the sex with the mate while in the mid air. Really? Right, so they're good at flying.、Uh, that sounds intense. Right, right. And another thing is that they eat their prey always, always、uh-huh. while flying. Right, if a dragonfly cannot fly for some reason,、okay. uh, it will starve for no food.、ね、right, right, right, they need to catch the food in the air. Wow, that、okay. sounds inconvenient. <laughs> right, right, they can't catch it even if it's right next to them, sitting next to them. Yeah, that's kind of inconvenient. Right, right. 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 Okay, the fourth insect you all really love. I'm only kidding there because you probably hate it. Okay.、Uh, anyways, these insects are flying again and they sting very hard.、Uh-huh. So it hurts very hard.、Uh, so it's not a mosquito. You can't、okay. say that one. And also, they have really huge nests.、Uh, right. And if you hit one of these,、mm-hmm. they will attack you. Oh, yeah. Everyone gets it. Right, right. Oh, everyone got this one. They, they sting you. They live in big nests. And if you hit one, they'll attack you. The answer is. They are hornets. Suzumebachi no koto desu. Right, in English it's called hornets or hornets. Gi- giant hornets.、Mm-hmm. Actually, K. They're very gentle,、uh, really? these hornets, because they don't attack people usually.、Okay. If you don't do anything to them,、okay. they don't do anything to you. They don't really like fighting that much. All right, all right. <laughs> And they're also a kind of wasp. Sometimes you hear this word in English, a wasp.、Mm-hmm. It's, it, it's a big group of these stinging things.、Okay. And a hornet is one kind of wasp. Okay, okay. Sus type, no, ne? That's right. Okay. Ne? One more interesting thing about these hornets. Is that、uh, Japanese honeybees、yes. uh, can kind of defend against hornets because if a hornet comes, the Japanese honeybees swarm around the hornet. Okay. ね。Yeah, only the Japanese honeybees are capable of doing this. Okay.、Uh, if you bring in European honeybees or something、mm-hmm. like that, they don't know how to swarm around,、oh, so they、right. have lots of problems against these hornets.、Yeah. Right, right. Okay, our final insect here. Everyone, you got all those so far the hornets, the dragonfly, the praying mantis, the ants. The final one is a very small insect. It's very, very small. And if it bites you,、okay. it has, it's like red itchy.、Mm. Red itchy.、ね right. And the final big clue is that they often live in the tatami mats. Okay. Right. Okay. So, this small insect that lives in the tatami, if they bite you, a red itchy spot. Everybody, you know in English what that is? That's a hard one. <laughs> okay, the answer is.、Uh, mites? Dani no koto desu ne. Right, mites. It's spelled M I T E S. Right, so it's different. It sounds the same as I might go there. But that's M I G H T, right? This is M I T E S. Right, mites. Dani desu. Right, they're also called tatami mites. Okay. Like that. Anyway, they don't only live in tatami mats, they also live in carpets or fatones,、mm. right? That's so if people put the fatones outside, then the UV light can kill them.、Mm. Right? ねのののね、right, and also if you vacuum the tatami mats, you can usually get right, rid right, of right, them right, like right. that. So, when up your futon. <laughs> <laughs> はい、皆さん結果はどうでしたでしょうかこの5つの質問のうち4つぐらい言えたら結構昆虫界で働いていけるんじゃないですかね、えー、今日のダイアログでは12個の虫の名前が出てくるのでそれらも合わせて覚えてみてください今日はドイツ人のフランツ君と日本人のノリコちゃんがお外でお話をしているところから始まりますまずはゆっくりなスピードで聞いてみましょう、right. 12 insects in today's podcast you can learn about all of them Ah, what's that ugly thing? Oh, that's a cute little centipede. Have you never seen one? Um, 
I've seen them in picture books, but this is the first one I've actually seen. Well, they're around. We see them once in a while. They're around here. All the spiders, cockroaches, and mosquitoes were already enough for me. Aren't there any bugs in Germany? Of course there are, but not so many, and they're not that big. I see. But I know. Japan also has good insects. Um, good insects. What are good insects? For instance, the fireflies in Japan are very beautiful. I've never seen any of them in Germany. Yeah. I love fireflies. Hey, I also saw a lot of boxes and nets for gathering beetles in the supermarket. Yeah, that's what kids like to do. Especially, they try to get cicadas and stag beetles. Have you ever seen stag beetles fighting? Haha, <laughs> it's cool. And a lot of kids have insects as pets. You don't do that in Germany. Not really. Most people are afraid of insects and don't want to have any of them nearby. When I was little, I collected a few to scare my sister. Haha. <laughs> Probably a few people in Germany collect them as a hobby, but it's not a big trend. Got it. By the way, you'd better keep your kitchen clean and make sure the front door. Isn't open for a long time. In the supermarket, you can also buy different traps and sprays to kill insects. But the insects aren't dangerous unless you're allergic to them. Thanks for the information. I think I'll take some photos of the bugs. And send them to my sister. Ha <laughs> ha. Ah, you're mean. Yeah, sometimes. <laughs> oh my gosh, what a little brother! He says he will take some photos of bugs and send them to his sister. <laughs> wow, wow, yeah, not wow. a good brother. Yeah, <laughs> he's an evil. Ha <laughs> ha, evil guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. えではまず最初の虫の名前に行ってみたいと思いますフランツ君がムカデを見てびっくりしていますセントピールでムカデという意味ですね Right, centipedes Right, centipedes Everybody, you hate them, right? In English they're called centipedes Centa means 100 and ped means legs They don't often have 100, I think But that's their name, 100 legs centipedes Okay, so just like Japanese Right, right, right でフランツ君は生のムカデを見るのが初めてなんだというふうに言っていますのりこちゃんはえー、彼らはたまにいるけどねというふうに言っています Once in a while でたまにとか折に触れてという意味ですね。Right. Once in a while means like sometimes.、Okay. For example, once in a while I go to Hiroshima City like that. でフランス君はムカデがすごい嫌いみたいでゴキブリとか蚊とか雲とかでさえいっぱいいっぱいなんだけどもうマジ無理っていうふうに言ってます。I don't wanna even say ゴキブリ。<笑> How do you call that in English? It's, they are called Cockroaches. Cockroaches. Right, and our other favorite friends are called mosquitoes. Uh-huh. Right, right. Cockroaches and mosquitoes. Uh-huh. 
、まあ、虫のことはあまり得意じゃないみたいなんですけど好きな虫もいるみたいでホタルが特に好きだっていうふうに言ってますじゃあ How do you call ホタル in English? A fireflies. Fireflies. Right. They're very beautiful、okay. insects, right? In, the, in June. Okay. Yeah, yeah. That's kind of a season. That's a season. That's a season. So, the super is a cup of tomas. 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 Right. They're called beetles or stag beetles, too. Right. Sometimes people have them for, for pets, right? Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I used to have one, actually,、oh, cool, when I was cool, little. Cool. で子供はそういうの好きだよねっていうふうに言ってますね。あとセミとかクワガタとかも好きだよねっていうふうに言ってますね。セケイラスってセミ、right? Right. セケイラス。セケイラス。セカダス。I think both are okay, okay. right, right. Anyway, they're very traditional in Japan. In America, they might have them in the southern states. Okay. Down by、um, Mississippi, Alabama, oh, 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 oh. around that area. But in the north, where I was from, Wisconsin,、mm-hmm. they didn't really have any cicadas. So、uh, I, I never heard them before I came to Japan. Wow, I'm so jealous of you guys. <laughs> wow. Why? You don't really like them、They're、so much? They're too noisy. They're too noisy. <laughs> で、えー、フランツ君は、うん、ドイツでは虫を集めたりしないんだよねっていうふうに言ってくれてます。で、のりこちゃん、そうなんだ、ガレっていうふうに言ってます。I got it って、わかったとか、理解したという意味ですね。Right. It's very, very easy to use. Got it. I understand like that. Especially with your friends. It's very okay. informal. Okay. Right. So it's really casual. <笑> right. でところで、キッチンはきれいにしといた方がいいよというふうに言ってます。Joe, what is this you'd better? It means like you should, but it's even stronger.、Mm-hmm. Um, it's like if you don't do something, something bad will happen.、Okay. For example, you'd better study.、Okay. Uh, if you don't, something bad will happen. And here in the dialogue, the woman says that you'd better keep your kitchen clean.、Mm-hmm. Right? If you don't, something bad will happen. The insects will come <laughs> yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, 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 yeah. でスーパーマーケットに行くとあのいろんなこう虫を倒すための罠とかスプレーが売ってるよっていうふうに教えてあげてます。Traps and sprays で罠とスプレーという意味ですね。Right, so you can use traps and sprays to kill insects. ゴキブリホイホイとかのことだと思います。Right, traps and sprays. まあでも、好き嫌いはあると思うけど、基本的に虫はあなたがアレルギーでない限りは安全なのよというふうにのりこちゃんは言っています。To be allergic to 何々で、何々に対してアレルギーを持っているという意味です。Yeah, notice it's a set expression.、Mm-hmm. To be allergic to something.、Mm-hmm. For example, she's allergic to cat fur.、Mm-hmm. 猫の毛がダメなんだっていう人もね、right. 結構いると思うんです、ね。Or he's allergic to pollen. うんうん、花粉がダメです。Right, right, right. That's a common one, right? で、今日の最後の面白い表現に行ってみたいと思います。フランツ君は、あ、よしよ、じゃあいっぱい虫の写真集めてお姉ちゃんに送ったろうというふうに言ってます。ここで、えー、のりこちゃんが、あ、ah,、you're mean っていうふうに言ってますが、この mean means kind of evil。That's right, right. Not so friendly, not so nice. 意地悪ってことですね。Right, right, right. And with that, let's listen to the dialogue at natural speed. And after this, we'll find out which insects K a y likes and which one she hates. <笑> Ah, what's that ugly thing? Oh, that's a cute little centipede. Have you never seen one? I've seen them in picture books, but this is the first one I've actually seen. Well, they're around. We see them once in a while. They're around here? All the spiders, cockroaches, and mosquitoes were already enough for me. Aren't there any bugs in Germany? Of course there are, but not so many. And they're not that big. I see. But I know Japan also has good insects. Um, good insects? What are good insects? For instance, The fireflies in Japan are very beautiful. I've never seen any of them in Germany. Yeah, I love fireflies. Hey, I also saw a lot of boxes and nets for gathering beetles in the supermarket. Yeah, that's what kids like to do. Especially, they try to get cicadas and stag beetles. Have you ever seen stag beetles fighting? Haha, <laughs> it's cool. And a lot of kids have insects as pets. You don't do that in Germany? Not really. Most people are afraid of insects. 
and don't want to have any of them nearby. When I was little, I collected a few to scare my sister. <laughs> Probably a few people in Germany collect them as a hobby, but it's not a big trend. Got it. By the way, you'd better keep your kitchen clean and make sure the front door isn't open for a long time. In the supermarket, you can also buy different traps and sprays to kill insects. But the insects aren't dangerous unless you're allergic to them. Thanks for the information. I think I'll take some photos of the bugs and send them to my sister. <laughs> ah, you're mean. Yeah, sometimes. <laughs> So, Kay, which insect do you hate? Everyone. <laughs> every insect. I don't like every... But your major is biology. <laughs> biology, but like I'm mainly like, I'm dealing with those fluffy little animal like mice. Oh, mice are, are yeah, better yeah, than insects. Better than insects, but okay. at least I only like spiders. Oh, spiders. Yeah, yeah, spiders that's are fine. Cool. Yeah, yeah. Okay, spiders. wow, that's kind of unusual, uh -huh. I think. Okay. And what insect do you hate, Joe? Okay, I will say probably number one is centipedes. Oh, Mukadehe. Right? They're pretty bad really? centipedes, right? Oh, 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 oh. If you see them, they move quick. Also, they travel in pairs of two. Mm. So if you find one in your house, there's probably another okay, one there, so right? Okay, so they're a couple. Okay. Right, right, right. And what insect do you like the most? Okay, I kind of agree with the man in the dialogue here that fireflies are nice. Mm. But also, uh, butterflies are beautiful, oh, okay. and dragonflies are mm. beautiful, right? They're all beautiful. Okay. Mm, of those three, maybe, maybe. I will choose uh, butterflies, because you can see them more often right, than right, fireflies. Right, right. Fireflies mm. are hard to find, so but now. butterflies are different varieties, things like that. Mm. Right, if you talk about this, it'll be a fun conversation. Mm. And we will see you next time at Hiroshima University's English Podcast. Bye. Mirasan, konnichiwa. Questions from our listeners. Hey, questions from our listeners. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pachi, and what's pachi, the question pachi. this week, uh, Kay? It's from Yuki in Japan. To Joe, thank you. Okay, Yuki. What do you think about the leader of America? The leader of America. <laughs> the I president? Guess, I guess they're talking okay. about the president here, so that would be Trump, right? Okay. And do, what do I think about him? Of course he's bad, right? <laughs> I wish he would uh, protect the environment more uh -huh. and have be more modest. Right, modest. Right, right. right, right. He should be more modest, I think. That would be nice, right? Um, but everybody out there, don't worry about Trump so much. He, he, I really don't think he will start a big war. Yeah. And also, in a, a short, near future, he will disappear when he loses the next election. Right, right, right. <laughs> right. <laughs> right, right, right. We'll see. Right, right, right. Yep. So, we'll see. 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 Yep. So, we'll see.